Well, I'm going to put you on the spot with a question that I get all the time over the phone, and that's, how can I attract bats to my bat house? <laughs> that, that's the million dollar question. If we knew that, we would be millionaires because we would just have the magic formula, of sell the bat houses, bats would come, everybody would be happy. All we can do is build it the best we can, situate it the best we can, and hope that we still have bats in the area that could use the bat house. Uh, bats are undergoing a lot of threats, a lot of stresses, uh, and even now we have this big fungal disease coming through called white nose syndrome that's killing off millions of bats across the eastern United States. So even where bats may have been formerly abundant, they may be in such reduced population level now that it's going to take a long time for them to rebuild and be able to recolonize some of these areas or your bat house. But if it's a good bat house and it's in a good area, bats will find it. Whether they use it or not depends on how well you did everything. And bats are curious, they're smart, they'll find all kinds of potential roosts, but you need to maximize your benefit, you know, the, the characteristics about the bat house that make it attractive and useful to bats to see if they settle in.